You're me. 
death in the grave He's overcome sin with the power to save My God is a warrior
your people are gathered Build in me your spirit and truth Touch me now, come feel this void in me I believe in you And I'm running after you You know I give my all to you Cause I believe I believe in you And I follow after you You know I give my all to you Cause I believe And welcome back to our online service. 很高兴能再次看到大家。我们非常期待今天的聚会。We're about to enter into a time of worship, so let's get our hearts ready to have an encounter with God. 让我们一同站立，高举双手来敬拜上帝。
的爱战胜了一切，如晨曦穿过了黑暗，我软弱，祝你荣耀彰显。
worship you. You are here, working in this place. I worship you. I worship you. You are here, moving in our midst. I worship. I worship you. You are working, oh God. You are here, working in this place. I worship you. I worship you. You are we make miracle work. Promise keep light in the darkness, my God. That is who you are. We make a miracle work. Promise keep light the darkness. My God, that is who you are. Ita chu, chu mo make a si, mo ting bari. Miracle 
you, worship team, for an amazing time of worship. 接下来是这星期的家事报告，提醒大家，我们荣耀儿童频道的影片将在上午十时半聚会后在 YouTube 及脸书上播放。Yep. We'd like to remind everyone, especially to all the Glory Kids out there, that our Glory Kids channel episode will be available for you to watch right after the service at 10:30 a.m. Don't forget to share it to your friends, whether it's on YouTube or Facebook. 接下来，如果您想给予十一奉献，可以在聚会后或周间奉献。您可以使用线上转账，以支票支付至荣耀基督徒中心或者 Booth 来奉献。That's right. If you'd like to give. Once again, you may either make an online bank transfer, make a check to Glory Christian Center, or use Boost. And that wraps up our announcements for today. And now, let's watch Sister Xu Yin's testimony from Life Group ZL3. 让我们在留言区写下我们对秀英姐妹的支持与鼓励。一起来观看一下影片。Hi everyone, I am Shiwing from Life Group JL3. Although I was a Buddhist, I came to church and attended Life Group because I was invited by Kim, my friend. I have been attended often over the past two years, but still, I was not a believer. This is because I find it difficult to trust in God. I had, at the point, gave up. On life group altogether, even though I did not believe in God, He was always looking up for me. My leader Emily Tam continued to encourage me to go closer in God. She was like a shepherd guiding her sheep home. Sis Emily always saw how much she cared about me and encouraged me to come to church. She knew. If I trusted and obeyed God, my husband would follow my steps as well. However, I still did not take any action until March last year, when I decided to rejoin the life group and go to church to once again to know more about God. Coming back to life group, there were many new members since I last attended. Everyone was very kind. And friendly, and it made me feel warm and welcome. I decided to commit myself to life group despite my busy schedule. I rearranged my time and my commitments just so that I would attend regularly. I also made the effort not to be late to church services, even though I go to hiking with my friends every Sunday morning. It would have been impossible to achieve all this if it wasn't for God present in my heart. I also pray and thank God for what He has done in my life. I enter His gates with thanksgiving and His courts with praise. Give thanks to Him, bless His name. Psalm chapter one hundred verse four. I was baptized a few months after coming back to life group. I feel that I am cherished and that life is more meaningful. I always pray and give thanks to God for everything that He has done in my life, no matter how big or small. During the MCO period, I also pray for my family because they are far away from me, namely my mother. Brother and my daughter, I thank God because all of them are healthy and fine. I have since continued to attend life group online, and made it a point to write down all my daily devotion in my notebook, so that I can refer back to the promises of God and understand them better. The daily devotion given during the MCO. Lily motivated me to read the Bible, although sometimes I may not understand the passages. I may not be perfect, but I know that God loves me despite my flaws and imperfections. I choose to continue to walk with Him and to grow closer in His Word 
so that I can hear, learn how to hear his voice. I am close to my Jack L3 family, which is an encouragement for me. From my past experiences, I often try to share the goodness, greatness, and power of God to my friends and will try to invite them to church because we need to praise Him for His mighty deeds, praise Him according to His excellent greatness, Psalm chapter 150, verse 2. I want to walk closer to God because God is my rock, my fortress, and my Savior. God is love. Amen. Good morning, everyone. 大家早上好。I would like to speak to you and into your life the goodness of the Lord. 我要宣告上帝的信实在你的生命里面。Now this morning, I would like to share with you on this topic: building your prayer culture. 今天早上我要与你们分享的主题就是建立你的祷告文化。Many have misunderstandings about prayers. 很多人对祷告都有误解。Many would think that prayers are only for those who are in trouble. 很多人会认为呢，只有遇上麻烦的人才需要祷告。You pray only when you you meet with difficulties or whenever you are struggling. 所以很多时候我们会觉得只有。只有那些有麻烦或者遇到困难的人呢，才需要祷告。But when everything is is doing well and moving well, ah, you don't need to pray. 所以当我们呢一切事情都很顺利的时候，我们就觉得我们不需要祷告了。That's why it's so difficult for under for us to understand what do you mean by A prayer culture. So, 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 And one of his disciples said to him, "Lord, teach us to pray." Lord, teach us to pray. 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 Other things. 其实呢，除了祷告，门徒从来都没有叫耶稣教导他们任何的事情。They could have asked Jesus, Jesus, teach us how to heal the sick. 其实呢，他们可以跟耶稣说，耶稣教导我们怎么样的医治病人。How to teach the word? 怎么样的教导神的话 ？How to change water into wine? 怎么样的能够让水变成酒 ？How to Open blind eyes. 怎么样能使到这个瞎眼的得看见 ？No, they didn't ask Jesus to teach them all those. 他们没有叫耶稣教导他们这些。The only one thing they asked Jesus to teach them was teach us how to pray. 所以唯一的一件事情，他们求耶稣教导他们的，就是教导他们祷告。The reason was this. 原因是什么呢 ？They have been Watching Jesus all the time. Because they often come to see what Jesus is doing. They saw Jesus praying all the time. 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 They saw Jesus An empty space. He would find a empty space. And he would pray. 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 He would
Not because he had a lot of problems. 不是因为他有很多的问题，他祷告。When Jesus prayed, 当耶稣祷告的时候 ，they saw the beauty of it. 他们看见那个祷告的美丽。They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. They saw how Jesus spent time with the Father. With the Father, 那耶稣如何的在祷告中享受与神相啊与神在一起的时间 ？And the more time Jesus spent with the Father, 所以耶稣越与神的时间越久。The more meaningful the relationship was that he had with the Father. 所以他与天父的那个关系就更加的有意义了。Prayer, 祷告 ，is spending beautiful time. With God, 就是呢，与神度过一段美丽的时啊时刻。Like the psalmist said, 就好像诗人说 ，Oh, I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. 我要永远的居住在神的圣殿。Oh, I will dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. 我要在我一生的年日都居住在耶和华的殿中。And in the presence of God, I would behold the Beauty of the Lord. 然后呢，在神的同在的里头呢，我能够来到仰望神的美丽。In that presence, there is gladness. 在神的同在的里边呢，那我能够喜乐欢心。There's a fullness of joy. There's a there's this pleasures forevermore. 所以有这个满足的喜乐，永远的福乐。The disciples saw all that in Jesus when he prayed. 所以这些的门徒呢，就是看见当耶稣祷告的时候，他们看见耶稣的生命就是有这些的特质。So they got all excited and inspired. 所以呢，他们非常的雀跃和被激励。And they asked Jesus. 他们就问耶稣。Jesus. 耶稣。Teach us how to pray. 教导我们祷告。I like to go back a little bit to a time when Jesus prayed. 所以呢，我要再次的来到看耶稣他的啊他的祷告。In Luke chapter three, verse twenty-one and twenty-two. 在路加福音的第三章二十一到二十二节。Here it says, "Now when all the people." Were baptized. Here, tells us that the people were baptized. Jesus was also baptized. Jesus was also baptized. And while he was praying, he was praying. 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 Came out of heaven. 有声音从天上来。You are my beloved son. 就说你是我的爱子。In whom and in you I am well pleased. 我喜悦你。Jesus prayed while he was being baptized. 耶稣他在受浸的时候呢，他就祷告。Many of us, when we've been baptized, will be saying, "Praise the Lord." 很多时候我们被啊，我们受浸的时候呢，我们就说赞美主。But Jesus was enjoying the presence of God. 但是呢，耶稣却享受在上帝的同在里边。The Bible says that there are a few things that happen here. 所以呢，圣经上告诉我们说，这里有几样事情发生。Because Jesus obeyed God. 因为耶稣他顺服上帝。His prayer came out of that love relationship. And that obedience. So Jesus' prayer is derived from God's relationship and His obedience. His relationship with the Father was a very intimate relationship. His relationship with the Father was a very intimate relationship. In the Word, Jesus says, "The Father loves me." So in God's Word, Jesus tells us that Jesus knows that the Father loves him. The Father sent me into the world. He says, "The Father loves me. He sent me." What I'm doing, the Father bear witness to me. So, 不管我做什么呢，天父为我做见证。The Father speaks to me. 天父对我来说话。The Father is with me. 天父与我同在。The Father has not left me alone. 天父并没有离弃我。I am in my Father. 我是与我的天父一起的。My Father is in me. 我的天父也在我的里面。And we are one. 我们是合而为一的。Jesus said, "I know the Father." 
天耶稣就说我认识天父。The Father knows me. 天父也认识我。I honor the Father. 我尊荣天父。And I give glory to the Father. 我将荣耀献给他。That is a kind of relationship that Jesus had with the Father. 耶稣与天父的关系就是如此的亲密。That's why when Jesus prayed, 所以当耶稣祷告的时候, He did not pray out of desperation. 祂不是因为那种的焦虑来到祷告。He was not pushed by Problems by struggles by COVID nineteen to pray. He was not pushed by problems, not because of fear. He prayed because he loved the presence of the Father. He prayed because he loved the presence of the Father. Was open. So, the Bible tells us that the heavens opened. The heavens was open. The heavens opened. There was the presence of God. God's presence. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. Just like Jacob when he was in his dream. To have the presence of God. Now hear this. Do not pray because you want to find God. Pray because you want to be with God. When we are in trouble, we think that God is not with us. That's why we need to pray and find God. God, where are you? So many times we pray, we need to find God. God, where are you? Now the truth is, even when you are in trouble, God is with you. Pray not to find Him. So prayer is not to find Him. Pray that you can be with Him in His presence. Prayer is that you can be with Him in His presence. An open heaven, a wide open heaven, or the presence of God, is God's presence. An open heaven is more important than any. Open door. So, this open heaven refers to God's presence more than any open door. Even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an open door, even though at times you need an For an open door, while you miss an open heaven. So, then we must not be content with an open door. This way, you may miss an open heaven. Jesus taught us how to pray. Jesus taught us how to pray. He said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room. You close your door." Jesus said, "Go into your room." Sometimes you need to close. You need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience an open heaven. So, sometimes you need to close certain door in order to experience Was the presence of the Holy Spirit, that anointing of the Holy Spirit in his life? So Jesus needed was the Spirit's descent, the Spirit's anointing in his life. You see, our misunderstanding about prayer. So many times, 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 our misunderstanding about prayer. So many That you want. So, 不要只是来到上帝的面前，跟神求你要的东西. 
Ask God for the person of the Holy Spirit whom you need. If I have the presence of the Holy Spirit in my life, there's all that I need, the anointing I need, the enabling I need, the power that I need. I can do all things, the Bible says, in Him who strengthened me. The Bible also says, a voice came out of heaven. Prayer, or the power of prayer, always comes from the power of of a voice. Not your voice. Not the voice of the enemies. But the voice of God. And in prayer, what God wants to say to you is far more important than what you want to say to him。所以在祷告的时候呢，上帝想对你说的话，远比你想要对他说的话来的重要。there was a person, his name was called Naaman. The Bible says he was covered with leprosy. He came to the prophet and said, Can you do something? To my sickness. And the Lord said to Naaman, Go to River Jordan and dip yourself seven times in the river, you will be healed. So the that was the voice of God to him. Very clear, very simple, very specific. Go to River Jordan. Dip yourself there seven times. You will be healed. But Naaman had a lot of voices in his head. Why can't the prophet come and pray for me? You want me to go to River Jordan, your river? Why don't why can't I go back to my own river? If you want me to be healed, why I need to go down seven times? Why not just one, two, three times? Naaman had a lot of voices going on in his head. He may not be wrong. But in prayer, it is not your voice, it's not the voice of the enemy. It's always the voice of God that is more powerful, more important than. Any other voices. The Bible also says, After that, God said, You are my beloved son, in whom I am well pleased. Prayer is about the pleasure of of relationship with God and is about pleasing God. God can do anything for us without us asking. In fact, all our needs, God already knew. Even before we open our mouth, God already knew. But God still say, Come to me in prayer. Because in the time spent with God, God enjoy our pleasure. 
因为上帝呢，他会非常的喜悦我们跟他一起的时间。We also enjoy God's pleasure. 我们也非常的享受与神的时间。It is like spending time with friends. 就好像我们跟朋友在一起。You enjoy his or their presence. They enjoy your presence. 所以你非常的喜欢啊，当跟朋友在一起的时候，你就是非常的喜欢跟他们在一块儿。That's why the Bible. That's why the Father said. 所以因此天父说。You are my beloved son. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the son whom I love. You are my beloved son, the I want to further let you know something. 我要让大家知道更多的东西。Jesus is praying for you today. 耶稣基督今天在为你代求。In First Timothy chapter two, verse five, it says. 在提摩太前书的第二章第五节告诉我们说。For there is one God and one mediator. Also between God and man. Because God is only one. In God and man, there is only one God. The man, Christ Jesus. Is the man Christ Jesus. Romans eight thirty four. Romans eight thirty four. Romans eight thirty four. Christ Jesus is he who died. Yes, rather who was raised. Who is now sitting at the right hand of God the Father? Now in God's right. What is he doing? He intercedes for us. He is doing what? He is interceding for us. And in Hebrews chapter seven, verse twenty-five. Hebrews chapter seven, verse twenty-five. Therefore, he is able also to save forever. Those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. So, therefore, those who draw near to God through Him. Let me conclude with this. I want to conclude with this. Luke twenty-two, verse thirty-one and verse thirty-two. Luke twenty-two, verse thirty-one and verse thirty-two. Jesus turned to Simon and said to Simon. 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 Jesus turned to Simon and said to But I have prayed for you, Simon. 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 That was what Jesus said to Simon. This is Jesus to Simon. Jesus told Simon. Jesus 就对西门说 ，Something is going to happen to you. 有些事情要发生在你的身上。But you don't worry. 但是你不要担心。I'm doing something for you. 我为我为你做了一些事情。But Simon. 但是西门。Other than that. You need also to do something for yourself. 但是你自己呢，也要去做一些事。In verse forty, 在第四十节 ，Jesus said to Simon. 耶稣就对西门说 ，Together with the other disciples. 当然也是对其他的门徒说。He said to them. 他就对他们说 ，Pray, oh pray, pray that you may not enter into temptation. 你们应当祷告，免得陷入试探。Pray, 祷告 ，Pray. You need to pray. You pray that you will not fall. 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 You pray that
may be interceding for you today. 也许今天耶稣为你来到代求。But if you do not pray, 但是如果你自己不祷告的话 ，there is no effect or there is little effect. 那效果呢将会没有或者是很小。That was what happened to Simon Peter. 这就是发生在西门彼得的身上。When Jesus said pray, 当耶稣说祷告 ，they went to sleep. 他们睡觉。Jesus went out and pray and came back. 当耶稣去了一个啊啊啊自己一个人祷告的时候，在回到他们当中的时候呢 ，they were sleeping. 他们在睡觉。Jesus woke them up. 耶稣就叫醒他们。Oh. You need to pray. Ah, you must come up and pray. When I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to pray. So when I pray for you, you need to And Peter was struggling, and he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what to do. So Peter, in his struggle, he did not know what And Peter was listening to his own voice, the voice of his fear. So, 呢，彼得呢就听自己的声音，那种是来自惧怕的声音。And the voices of the enemies. 然后，甚至是他听见仇敌的声音。The father didn't say, and Jesus didn't say, Simon Peter, I'm pleased with you. 所以，因此呢，耶稣或者是天父都没有跟彼得说，彼得，我喜悦你。At the end of the day, 到到最后 ，Peter failed. He walked away. He just walked away. Jesus said to Peter earlier. So, actually, Jesus, very early, said to Peter, "I am praying for you. I am praying that your faith will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, you will not fail. Because if you have faith, The reality was. 但是事实上就是 Peter failed. 彼得他失败了 He walked away. 他走开了 He disappeared for the next three days. 接着下来的三天他失踪了 Even when Jesus was nailed on the cross, Peter was not there. 即使是耶稣钉在十字架的那时刻呢，彼得也没有在那里 Well, Jesus prayed. Jesus, he prayed. And yet, Peter fell. But Peter still failed. 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 Peter still But if you do not pray, 但是如果你自己不不祷告的话 ，if you do not build a prayer culture, a culture that that gives you the joy and the pleasure to spend time with God. 如果你自己没有建立这个祷告文化，你没有建立这个能够来到神的面前享受他的同在 ，there is little effect of the intercessions of Jesus. For you, then Jesus Christ for you, will bring very little effect. Lockdown, is a very good opportunity for us. 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 Get motivated. We really need to have this kind of energy. Get inspired. We need to be inspired. Get stirred up. We need to be stirred up. Get excited. We need to be excited. 
to pray because you love God. 就因为我们爱神，所以我们祷告。But you say, 可能你说 ，Pastor, I don't really love God that much. 那你就就说，你说牧师啊，我真的不是很爱神。I don't enjoy His presence that much. 我真的是不是很享受他的同在。Then get motivated by your obedience to His word. 那你就开始呢。透过你顺服上帝的话语，得到那个动力。Knowing that when there is obedience in the word of God in your life， 所以当你要很清楚知道，当你在你的生命的当中，你顺服上帝的话语 ，There is God working with you and working for you。然后呢，你又看到呢，神的话语正是为你工作，和你一起工作。But you say, Pastor， 但你说牧师啊 ，That is also not me。但我也我也不会享受这样子。啊，哎。I, I'm not the one who want to obey what God is saying. 我不是那个想要去顺服上帝啊的话语的人。So how do I get motivated and inspired? 我怎么样能够能够得到这种的动力，能够得到这种的激励呢 ？Well, if you cannot be motivated by your love for God, 那如果你不能够因为爱上帝而得到这个动力 ，and you cannot be motivated. By your obedience to God, 而你也不能够因为顺服上帝而得到动力。Then at least, 至少 get motivated by your problems. 至少你能够在你所面对的问题的当中得到这个动力。Start from where you are. 你就是从你可以在哪里开始，你就在哪里开始。I don't have love for God. You say I don't have that kind of obedience. 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 I don't Talking, the sharing with God. So, 慢慢的你就会享受与上帝的对话，你跟上帝所分享的。Build that love relationship with God. So, 慢慢的你就开始呢，会来到爱慕上帝了。Slowly, you find that obedience to God's word is not a burden. So, 慢慢的你就会知道说，哎，原来顺服上帝的话语不是这么难的。That is what I call a prayer culture. In your life, 这就是我对你说的，你生命的祷告文化。Build a prayer culture. 建立祷告的文化。Your walk with God will be different. 你和上帝的同行将会不一样。You will be always walking in His presence. 你会时刻在他的同在里边。There will always be an open heaven. Over you, 而常常会有敞开的天。Let me pray for you. 让我为你祷告。Father God, I thank you. 天父，我谢谢你。I thank you that Jesus is interceding for every one of us, even right now. 天父，我谢谢你，因为即使是现在，耶稣基督为每一个人来祈求。We also know that there is little. In its effect, if we don't commit ourselves to pray, 我们也知道，若我们自己没有祷告的话，那耶稣在天上的祈求也不能够有许多的这种的效力。Father God, I pray for a fresh spirit to come upon these your people who are listening right now. 天父，我祷告，这个崭新的灵。充满在听这个信息的每一个你的子民。The Lord, you stir up a new fire inside every one of us to wanting to build a prayer culture in our life. 天父，你让我们每一个人重新的燃起这个的热，这这这个的热情，我们要建立这个祷告的文化。Let them experience the joy, the pleasure, and the gladness. Of your presence. So, in this, we can enjoy the presence of God. Your presence brings us joy, that kind of joy, that kind of happiness. So that prayer can become a privilege than a burden. So, in this, 
，祷告不再是一个重担，祷告乃是一件非常我们能够去享受的一个非常荣幸的事情。Even at this moment. 即使是在这个时刻 ，I pray that every individual, every family be touched by your presence right now. 我祷告每一个人、每一个家庭都被你的同在触摸。Those who have needs, Father God, touch their needs and fulfill their needs. 主啊，有任何需要的，主你触摸他们，你满足他们的需要。Those with sickness, Father God, touch their bodies and allow them to be healed in Jesus' name. 身体有疾病的，奉耶稣基督的名字，现在就得着医治。Father God, I pray. 天父，我祷告。There's a dimension of joy in prayer. And this, your people and their families. 主，我祷告，当你的子民和他的家庭一起祷告来到你的面前的时候，他们是喜乐的。In Jesus' name. 奉耶稣基督的名字。Amen. Amen. 
God, you are. God, you are beside me. Always there to lead me. I will not be shaken. I put my trust in you. Jesus, you're amazing. Glorious You are beside me, always there to lead me. I will not be shaken. I put my trust in you. Jesus, you're amazing. Glory is everlasting. I will sing forever. Lord, there is none like it. Oh, I sing. I sing forever. Come to the end of today's service. 希望今天上帝的话语能使您蒙福。欢迎大家追踪我们 GCCKK 的社交媒体，以得到最新消息。The Lord bless you. The Lord loves you, and we love you too.